What's up, heroes? I'm a rising hero, and welcome back to another minimum discussion. Uh, for those, well, I'm pretty sure you guys already know, but for those who do not know, this minimum discussion is going to be about minimum servers coming back early 2016, so this year. But I'm gonna read you guys, I'm gonna read you guys their progress report. I'm going to kind of hopefully iron out any questions you guys have for the game through what I'm gathering through this progress report and then I'm gonna kind of explain to you guys what I think minimum should do and how things are going and when I think we can expect minimum to come back uh, so yeah let's get started so I'm gonna do the power of editing boom I'll show you this progress report there you go you guys should be able to see now um, progress report December 10th 2000 uh, 15. Again, I've been aware ever since the day they very first posted this, but again, I didn't just get enough time to uh, do the report on it, or not do the report, but tell you guys about this, tell you my subscribers and viewers, because again, I never once said that Middle would never be coming back. I even told you guys in the first one, before this was even a thing, that there's a good chance Middle will come back, but it'll be come back 2016, and I guess I was right. So uh, let me go ahead and read this for you guys. Um, Greetings Minimum fans. We'd like to give you an update on the progress we're making towards getting Minimum back up and running. As we previously announced, we have, work we have been working diligently to replace the gameplay and account server architecture after unforeseen closure of the third party servers powering these systems. We have enlisted a development partner with significant experience working the member platform to help and they have made significant progress in getting the key systems we built. Atari and Human Head have jointly agreed to move the game to this new team going forward. The development team has made steady and significant progress towards getting the game back up and running. But there are still a few pieces left to iron out. We are currently able to spin up a, an internal server, manually join in players and run matches. We are now focusing on the various progression, customization, components, blueprints, unlocks, loadouts, etc. Based on current progress, the game should be back up and running in early 2016. We will update this timing as we learn more detail. Again, we truly appreciate your patience as we work through the process of rebuilding the account server structure for minimum. We understand this is an inconvenience and we are working as quickly as possible to get everything resolved. Thanks and happy holidays, the Minimum Team. So, interesting progress report, right guys? Kinda interesting. Um, so, apparently as of right now, you can join servers uh, through the game. Now, by that I made no we the players cannot, but of their development team, apparently when they run a server they could join in play and join out. Now how smoothly that is, if the same bugs that were in the game previously are out, I cannot say that. They may be in or they may be not, because again, they said they redid all of this, so there's a good chance some of the bugs that originally were in the game very well may be squashed because they had to rewrite the system. Um, but beyond that, they also said, if you notice, um, the various progression customization components. So. Pretty much, this may very well be leaning on to, we may not, um, we may or may not have all of our unlocks when we load in the game for the first time, again, in a long time, so, um, I would tell you guys to, uh, be wary of that, but the cool thing, though, is the fact that the weapons is saved to our Steam, so, even if they deleted our data, the worst thing that could happen is our... Um, what's it called? Our player level could be reset to zero. I think that's the worst that could ever happen, to be honest with you guys. So for those who have uh, uh, weapons and unlocks, I have a very good chance we're going to have that because it's linked to your Steam account. It isn't linked to the game itself. Um, because if you guys look at the Steam Workshop or the Steam Community uh, Marketplace, you can actually buy them and then when you would load in the game, you would have it. So yeah, I would say I don't think they have anything or you have anything to worry about when it comes into the things that you've gotten. So another interesting thing that they were talking about that eh, 
it's a little, it's a little scared me. Is this sentence right here? Uh, right here. Uh, actually, I'll start right here. We have been working diligently to replace the gameplay and account server architecture after an unforeseen closure of the third party servers powering these systems. Why this scares me is because in the next sentence, on the last sentence of the second paragraph, it says, Atari and Human Head have jointly agreed to move the game to this new team going forward. Um, that scares me. This scares me here. This, this scares me. I don't, I mean, I understand that Atari has some rights to the game, so I guess it's impossible to take out all rights away from Atari as of now. But if I was Human Head Studios, I kind of would have, I would have rebuilt the game from the ground up again with zero affiliation of Atari, but I guess because they own the name, they can't do too much about that, you know? Uh, but that does worry me. Atari worries me, and um, I guess they're, I guess since it being a, a Unreal Engine 4 game using a member platform, I guess, they have to get someone to, uh, with this kind of experience to build the game back up, I guess. And it looks like they said they already had a person and apparently they really did make a lot of development uh, breakthroughs, I guess, fixing everything. So I guess that's that's really nice to hear, I guess, in that way. And um, I guess now I got to tell you guys what I personally think, really. Um, hmm. Okay, I got some I got some things to say. I have some things to say. Okay, where should I start? Okay, first of all, um, let me start in where I think minimum is going to come back I think minimum is going to come back May of 2016 um, if we're fortunate as early hopefully as April most likely not but I think around May would make the most sense um, for us to expect progress reports because um, I have a feeling human head and the new development team is it just gonna release a game that's the exact copy with now working with servers I feel like they're going to be doing other changes when we load in. Um, a lot of things are going to be changed. Maybe the GUI may look dr drastically different. The characters may look slightly different. The maps may have changed a bit. Who knows? I do think there's going to be significant changes that when we get in the game, there's going to be some some changes. Now, I'm not going to say there's going to be whole weapons missing. I don't think the changes to be that drastic. But I do think we will be getting uh, more systems fixed so that they work correctly specifically the mission system and I hopefully would think optimizations as well um, but beyond just release date and content I think the best course of action for minimum to do for the minimum team in Atari and even human Head studios I think the best thing it would do is to reboot the game to kind of do a big relaunch of minimum believe it or not i i think that if they post a brand new trailer out for the game they get some kind of buzz right before it comes out i think that would be the best thing for minimum because there's a high chance of minimum coming back us players the dedicated players will love it but the generally people may not like it and I feel like that might kill minimum before it even begins to come back. So I think minimum has to do a reboot. They have to do a big like re-release kind of. Again, not re-release as in we buy the game again. No, no, no. As in let's uh show off the new things that minimum didn't have before, all the problems fixed. Hopefully a live stream when the game first comes back and uh and things like that cuz um Minimum in all in all seriousness, it's a good game. It's just that the uh, the teams behind it has had a lot of issues about it. It um plus two. If you if you look at the comments here, uh, let me go back to the uh, Steam community thing. Uh, if you look here, um, a lot of people now it is true. It is a little bit broken when you load it up. I believe the executable is gone now. So yeah, it, it's a little strange there. Um. People are saying they want a refund, they want a, they want the game back, but I can um, tell you guys for sure the game probably will be coming back around May. At least that's my 
um, interpretation of when it'll come back. But, um, yeah, guys. I uh, Minimum's facing some pretty big stuff. I hope the game doesn't get officially canceled. And for those who are saying that they aren't communicating, or they haven't communicating for a very long time, that is true because it's been around 40 days or so. But again, I want you guys to realize something. They're, because they're a team working under a company, things are going to move significantly slower than, say, me as a person working on the game because I'm completely devoted to the game and there is no middleman. It's just me and the game. With them, they have Human Ed Studios, then you have the team working for minimum, and then you have Atari that they have to get through to work to the game, and then you have all the game's problems on top of that. So... If you really think about it in that sense, it's a lot that they have to get through. But I do want a progress report as of next month. I think we deserve as much as that. At least a progress report every two months or so. And I think um, I'll, f I'll feel a little bit better about the game coming back. But guys, I hope you did enjoy this uh, minimum discussion. I kind of hope I explained a few things that maybe you guys wanted to hear or my thoughts. Because uh, my overall thoughts is minimum, I think we'll definitely be coming back the first half of 2016. So hopefully within these six months of the first year, it'll be back. And um, if it is, then I'll be happy. And when it does come back, let's hope the game updates regularly and fixes the problems that are in it. That's all we can really hope for because we're just players. We don't have control over any of this. But I'll see you guys in the next uh, video. Um, hopefully in another minimum discussion where I'll be talking about Hopefully some new stuff that will be coming out with Minimum. I don't know. Um, again, I do want to tell you guys, my subscribers, about Minimum. Because it's a big part, or at least was a big part of my channel. I want it to be a big part again when it comes back. Because I love Minimum. It's great. And um, I'll see you guys in the next episode. And don't forget to be a hero.